Hey everybody, I'm here today to show you how to find the LCM and GCF using the ladder method. This will be a simple math tutorial, so let's get right into the video. Now I'm going to pick two numbers, and we're going to find the LCM and the GCF, which is the lowest common multiple and the greatest common factor, just so it's clear what the uh, short forms mean. So I'm going to pick two numbers, we're going to pick 48, put it over here, 48, and 72, just like the number of hours in two and three days on a random side note. Now what we want to do is we want to start off by finding the smallest prime number that goes into both numbers. So I'm going to draw a little L like this. And we want to find the smallest prime number that goes into both numbers, which in this case is going to be two. Okay, so I put a two on the side there. Now I'm going to take both of these numbers and divide it by this smaller number. So 48 divided by two is actually 24. Okay, and then 30, uh, sorry, 72 divided by 2 is 36. I was going to say 36 divided by 2 because I didn't know what the answer is. I have this written down beside me just so it's very clear. Now what we're going to do is we're going to draw another line like that, just like a ladder. We're making a ladder, okay? Now, once again, we're finding the smallest prime number that goes into both, which is 2, okay? 24 divided by 2 is 12, and 36 divided by 2 is 18. Draw another ladder just like that. Once again, we are doing uh, the smallest prime number that goes into both, which is going to be 2 again. 12 divided by 2 is 6. 18 divided by 2 is 9. Draw a ladder just like that. And then last but not least, uh, the smallest prime number for these would be 3. So 3 goes into both of those numbers. 6 divided by 3 is 2. And then 9 divided by 3 is 3. And we're waiting until we have all prime numbers going down this way and down this way. So right now we have all prime numbers going down this way and this way. Now, to actually find the LCM, the lowest common multiple, so LCM, okay, all that we have to do is take all of these numbers all across here, okay? So we're taking all of these, let's draw another line like this, all of these in the outer bracket, and we're multiplying them together. So we have is 2 times 2 times 2 times 3 times 2 times 3, okay? So let's do it. 2 times 2 is 4, times 2 is 8, times 3 is 24, times 2 is 48, times 3, 48 times 3 is 144. That's our LCM, 144. To find our GCF, our greatest common factor, <clears throat> all that we are actually going to do is we're going to multiply um, all of the numbers together on the actual uh, on the actual uh, L. Sorry about that. Sorry, just down the like the, just down the the side of the L. That's the word I'm looking for. So just down over here, we're multiplying all of these together um, to find the GCF. So let's just write that down. Sorry, I confused myself for a second. There. GCF equals, and that would be all these. So two times two times two times three. So two times two is four times two is eight times three is twenty four. So our GCF is going to be twenty four. And that's it. So literally that simple. That is the ladder method for finding the LCM and GCF. If you like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below as a comment. And of course, be sure to subscribe for more great videos just like this one. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.